Hey folks, it's Kikoskia here, and welcome back to Let's Replay Icewind Dale The Enhanced Edition. And when last we left off, we made our way through the lower areas of Dawn's Deep to here, the glacier. And there is a museum just to our east. How do I know it's the museum? Because I've already explored it technically. I recorded a whole set of Icewind Dale, and something went terribly wrong. I make the mistake of minimizing the window, and everything recorded correctly, but the video itself. I had my audio, I had the in-game audio, and one frame, the frame that I minimized on, for three videos, which of course is completely unusable. I... But we're not going to be going there this time round in this timeline, we're instead okay. going to head to another location, where hopefully we'll find something different. There is, Ready. however... A group of enemies in our way that I do know are coming. So we're going to wait for them. I'm we're going here. to take their time Not getting to us. Problem. There are also a couple of trolls here. There's hmm? one of them. Hello, how you doing? The answer is you're going to die. And there is a third ice troll there. There are also these uh, bodies here. These bodies are linked to the uh, museum. That again, we're not going to be visiting just yet. Well, at least I hope we're not going to be visiting it just yet. And this is when the uh, game goes, actually, you have no choice but to visit the museum. And I go, darn it! But, well, you know, I have to go there eventually. I'm here. Right, we'll grab these gems. This place really likes throwing gems at you, by the way. It really likes throwing gems at you. Hey, you need me? I'm here. It's not the best treasure I've seen in is any D&D uh, &D campaign. Oh, hello. There is a... Uh, the first of the very dangerous trolls, hmm? and there is the second of the very dangerous trolls. Yes, we're going to move you two back. Right. We're going to deal with you like that. Then we're going to deal with you quickly, and then hopefully a burning hands. Ready. That's a lot of critical hits, by the way. Hopefully a burning hands will take care of both of them. It, it should done. take care of both of them. And there we go. The first time we managed to get rid of two I'm with here. one spell. I'm not quite sure what uh, treasure I like the most when it comes to a D and D campaign. I think I prefer like weapons and armor. But your mileage may vary. What's your favorite type of treasure? Why don't you let me know in the comments if you uh, have a favorite? Right, there is another one of these trolls. We'll take care of you as quickly as we can. We'll also oh, here we go. We'll also have you do that. And you're down. Right, go there. We'll have you burning hands this. There we go. And we could go this way, which leads to the museum. But this time round, I'm going to head over this rickety bridge. And how do I know that it's a rickety bridge? Because the map literally tells me it's a rickety bridge. We will rest. And, oh, trolls. We could take care of these trolls. Now, there is an area way back in the caverns area of Lower Dawn's Deep that I didn't go to before. There is a uh, building that I didn't know where to, the uh, path to what reach it was. That path is right by the entrance, and we will go and check that place out when we eventually leave. Because we're not going to see this chapter all the way through, we're going to go back to Kaldahar and... Oh, more of you. And go and uh, do the expansion content. What is your These enemies are really that not that difficult. Compared to all of the uh, other ambush foes, you hit occasionally, but not that much. Okay, you are hitting Iona a fair bit. But that was a few nice crits and one splatted troll. Can we rest now? Yes, we can! Marvelous. Okay. Save. In this new timeline. You never get to see the old timeline, by the way. Not a problem. And... The bridge is in poor shape and may collapse, you can Oh no, we have to do- Oh no, we have to do the museum. Oh, we have to do the museum before we can go over there. Okay, we're gonna pick a different route then. If we can't go over the bridge, we'll go a different way. Yeah, there's a book that you get in there that you need to get over that bridge. We'll go a different route. After we first take care of this Etim. There's only one Etim. There we go, heading down. Okay, there are other pathways. There is a pathway over here and a pathway over there. Let's go over here. And see what's in this direction. The answer is probably 
bad stuff. Yep, more trolls. What is it? We can deal with these trolls. Uh -huh. We'll just uh, fight you. And hopefully win. What? One more hit should do a trick. There we go. And we'll just heal you yeah. while we grab this gem. I had a feeling it wasn't going to be as simple as just walking over that rope bridge. Mm -hmm. I had a feeling it wouldn't be that simple. But I hoped it wouldn't be that complicated uh, a process to repair it. Hides all sorts. It does. It does. You're right. What's over here? The answer is... Ooh, stairway. And another body. Let's go this way. Ah, hi, troll. How you doing? Yes. The answer is you are soon ready going to perish. Me. Just need to ready a... Uh, oh, we done it. We done it. Don't waste any more arrows. Don't waste any more arrows. I want you to cast this spell, please. It's a shame we don't have a thing that allows us to deal fire damage without casting spells. Oh, dear. You're going to attack my... Uh, please don't. Please don't. I'd much rather you didn't. Ah, you have changed targets. Excellent. It's not going to take you that long to uh, deal with this troll now. Oh, gone. Excellent. This is another troll down. And another gem. And what's up here? Another troll? Hey, it's another troll. Ooh, and a stairway. Hmm, interesting. Hmm? I do not remember this stairway. I don't remember it. Could be anything behind that uh, loading screen. Even more enemies! Okay, chances there are going to be more enemies is actually really high. There we go! Right, let's have a look at what this says it is. Because normally when you find a stairway, it'll tell you what it is. An ice tunnel. Okay. Just a tunnel full of ice. We can deal with that, maybe. This is... Ooh, it just leads to uh, elevated locale. Hey, Glacier Yetis! It's been a while air? since we faced doing? a Yeti or two. Are they difficult? No, is the answer. They really, really aren't. Hmm? They are giving us a thousand experience each, though. We'll grab these pelts. And we'll put them in the bag of holding. And all of these as well. It's good that we have absolutely loads of uh, gem bags. Do you have a gem bag? You actually don't have a gem bag. One of the few people that doesn't. There we go. Ready. So over there is nothing. I'm here. Over here... Are probably going to be a few more Glacier Yetis. Yep, there's a Glacier Yeti. Are you actually going to reach us? No! No, you're not. No, you're not. And neither are you. Look at that Thacko in action. Look at that Thacko in action. A Thacko of five. And just think, we could get even better bows. This one has a Thacko plus two. Ready. We'll probably Ready. find Ready. a... Uh, Better one at some point. Oh, oh another Yeti. Yes. I think there are a few items in uh, in this location, in this map. I haven't found them yet. One of them might be a bow, if memory serves. That is not the right bag. That's not the bag of holding. I'll um, put that in there. Oh, another Yeti. How you doing? The answer is, you're soon going to be dead. Oh, watch out. There we go. Victory is ours. And more Yeti pelts. Not really worth that much, but uh, we'll take them. Is that all? Okay, if we go around... Oh boy, it's another Yeti, everyone. Surprising no one. More Yetis. I'm actually on the top of the museum right now. Hello. Oh, you actually switched to your sword. This is not a good Should idea. You are much death. worse with your sword. Mm. Mm. Case in point, look mm. at how much I... less Rita! damage we're dealing. Iona, however, much better with a sword. 
Although when Magnus does hit, it's a lot of damage. It's a lot of damage. You have a Thacko of five with both of them, actually. Huh. I'm here. I thought you were actually worse with the sword. I'm you're actually just as good, but you don't have the mastery, so you don't get all the bonus attacks and everything else. Uh, is there anything over here at all? Just more yetis. Do not toy with me. These aren't even glacier yetis. These are just yetis. These are just normal yetis. No wonder they've been so easy to take out. So is there anything here that I actually want? Or have we just cleared this area out for no reason? Well, I suppose clearing it out has a purpose. Yep, that's uh, just an area with nothing. Okay. So we have an ice tunnel, we have this location, and we have the museum that we're going to have to eventually go into if we want to get to the other person. But we're not going to go to the other person yet. We're going to delay. We don't want to go in the museum just yet. There are, I think, some goodies for us to uncover. So I do need to press tab a bit more often. But those ice tunnels are just going to be full of trolls. Full of trolls. Let's go down here. Probably find a couple more trolls. Yep. Wasn't expecting two at once, but you know. On trolls! Oh no, it's three! It's three at once. Alright. Move on. So be it. No, no, no. Stop I... hitting that one. If I must. Ah, we have a minor problem. That problem is that uh, you're blocking the way. So actually, I'm going to use my dragon's breath here. That will absolutely help. Ready. I'm here. Can you just start doing that to hit there. Yes. And that should probably do the trick. Uh, you could have fall. Come on. Come on. There we go. That was a lot of damage you took there. That was a lot of damage. But, should be okay. There we go. Some gems. Truly a great treasure. And we'll carry on exploring. Uh, nothing here. Okay, we do go down. Down, down. Oh, you managed to get all the way to there before you succumbed. Okay, I'm a here. snow troll what and a ice troll. The ice troll is the more uh, immediate foe, but this foe is the more dangerous one. Are you gone? Yes, you are. Can we just have you kill this, please? Thank you. Gotcha. Got some gems, and you can pass those gems off to Radella. There we go. You prob oh, you both need some healing. Quite badly. Fortunately, the druid can heal thyself. Using heal. Bit of overkill, considering it's not 150 health we've lost, but uh, it'll do the trick. I forget how big this area is. It truly is a large location with a lot of things that you can check out. Most of which is just... Here are some enemies, but there might be a few goodies the that we hides all that we might uh, stumble across. Okay, forward. Oh, more bodies! More bodies! Hi, another troll. I'm here. Okay, let's uh, just have at thee with you. Will you actually reach us? You. Really right, now. No problem. Okay, here is a door, and another door, and another door. All of which I bet we can't open, because I think right. they are locked by behind the uh, yes. requirement of getting the key in the museum. What? So you're gone, and we'll just take care of what is you. That? Okay, I stop think. that. Hit there. Hmm? Is that all? Now, Ready? you it will be done. go use your last burning hands. Okay, done that. I am by your side. 
Can I actually unlock it though? Will the game just let me unlock it from this side? I am here. I see. See. I'm on it. Can I unlock it? Or can I just open it? Yes. I can in fact just open the door. Okay, this is the the museum basement entrance. I have I in fact just entirely circumvented a puzzle? I don't know. Uh, let's find out by going in. No. This is not what I thought it would be. Good is done. Hmm. This niche holds a statue of a male dwarf holding a workman's hammer. At the base of the statue is a plaque proclaiming him as Dugmar and Brightmantle, the Tinkerer. Okay, is this door... This door is not openable. Yeah, this Ready. door is not openable. We're gonna need the key for that. This room, however, is perfectly safe to rest in, which is good. Okay, what's in here? Oh! Is that all? Um... Yeah, this is... This is where we're meant to be to do, like... Plot significant stuff. So... I don't know if we can now just say that the Idea. way is... Free? Because these are escape slaves. They're escape slaves from the Frost Salamanders on the main level. And they are desperate for a way out, but I think I've just got them a way out. Because I've just opened the door. Hundreds of books line these shelves. Most of them appear weather damaged and ready to crumble. Let's say hi. My name is Soth. Is there something I could help you with? Or could may I ask you some questions? Certainly. What do you want to know? What are you doing here? Well, I fancy myself to be a bit of a scholar, so I'm trying to go through some of these books and learn a bit about this place. Had any luck? Yes, it's hard reading, but I pieced a few things together. But what have you learned? It seems that this entire complex is a temple dedicated to Dugbaran Brightmantle. Dugbaran? He's the dwarven god of scholars, inventors, and explorers. Yes, quite right. He's not well known and frowned upon by some of the other gods. They consider him to be a bit whimsical, I guess you'd say. Anyway, Dugbaran felt the dwarves should get out and explore the world more. Fun fact, if you don't talk to Soth with a dwarf, you don't get that dialogue option. I see. What else can you tell me about this place? A brilliant architect known as Alconos the Visionary built this complex. He was a devout follower of Dugmar and took offense that his deity had no formal temple. So he petitioned the king and was granted permission to construct one. During the construction, he became known as Alconos the Mad. Why did they call him that? Well, apparently most of the dwarves wanted to just bore a tunnel through his glacier and build a small temple in the mountain on the other side. Alconos would hear nothing of it. Instead, he began construction on a grandoise scale. And here's the result. Uh, if the dwarves thought him mad, why did they not stop him? Oh, they tried. Now, I may not have the lineage exactly right, but it appears that Alconos was related to the king of the time. He was either a nephew or a cousin. I don't know which. In, e in any case, the king couldn't admit that one of his relatives was a brick shy upstairs. It would be a bad reflection on him. Interesting. Let me ask you something. How did you come to be here? On my, on my way from Orkney to East Haven. Raiders waylaid the caravan I was with, and I was knocked unconscious. When I awoke, I was here. I've never heard of Orkney. Orkney's located on the other side of the spine of the World Mountains. It's a small place. I don't think it has made it on the maps yet. Let me ask something else. Have you examined most of the books here? Yes, I have. Didn't take as long as you would think, because most of them are so damaged as to be unreadable. It's a shame, too, because the few that are readable are excellent works on dwarven engineering. There is a rope bridge here in danger of collapsing. Could I learn to repair it using some of the books here? I don't rightly know. I suppose it's worth a try, though. Let's see. Bridges. Yes, here you go. This one covers the basics of suspension and such. Good luck. We got 112,500 experience for that. I did not know that we would get that. Thank you, Soth. Farewell. That's a lot of XP! We gained an item, Engineering Manual. This ancient work is a treasure on Dwarven engineering techniques. Although it is written entirely in the Dwarven language, someone has inserted translated notes in several places throughout the book. This particular volume contains a detailed analysis on the construction of suspension bridges. 
Ready. Marvelous. So, we are going to I'm go here. out of here Ready. now. We got a cool thing. Now, we could just go and talk immediately to the leader of the escaped slaves. But, I think there's more experience to be gained Done. by going and heading into the museum Easy via this entrance. There's also some damage to be sustained doing this, because Frost Salamanders have a cold aura, and that's not a fun thing to come up against. But, these are not enemies we should worry about, and we can learn a lot of information by just playing along with the suspicions of the leader. What do I mean by that? Oh, you'll, you'll see in time. You'll see in time. And so, when we come back, folks, we'll go into the museum proper, and we will complete a very quick quest. This is a very quick quest indeed. You'll see how quick in a bit. And so, I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later.